First and foremost, no, ain't, no, ain't no heathens going to be doing that, man. Right? Scripture says, if great favor be shown to the wicked, they, they still choose to do wicked, right? So that ain't talking about no, no, no heathen out here. That's talking about, that's talking about an Israelite, you know, a man, a man who, who, who is, you know, a man who's from that, that, that royal line, man. Right? It says, he, he saw in a vision, evidently about the ninth hour of the day, an angel who, an angel of God coming in, in, into him and saying unto him, Cornelius, all right? And he says, now first of all, why is the angel of the most high going to be talking to, 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 to a long age of like, Where is he going to be talking to Eve, all right? He says, and we're going to see it anyway, we're going to see it. He says, and God coming into him and saying unto him, Cornelius, and when he looked on him, he was afraid and said, Wait, what is it, Lord? And he said unto him, Thy prayers and thine arms are come up, uh, are come up for a memorial before God. Right? And he said, And send now men from a, uh, sorry, uh, Joppa and call uh, uh, for one Simon, whose name is Peter. He lodged with, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, so it's like it says, and send, uh, and send, uh, and, and send now men to Joppa and call uh, one of, uh, call one Simon, whose surname is Peter, and he lodged with Simon a talent. Right now, we'll uh, skip down a little bit. All right, just down to. night first he says on the morrow as they went on they, they journeyed they, uh, their journey and drew nigh unto the city Peter went up upon the housetop uh, to pray about the sixth hour right and he became very hungry and he uh, would have eaten but while they made ready he fell into a trance right so he fell asleep basically right he says uh, and now he saw and saw the heavens and he saw a heaven opened and right, certain right, vessels you. descending upon him as it had been a good <coughs> sheet knit at the four uh, corners and let down to the earth. So he was basically having a vision of uh, vessels coming down on you know, coming coming down on him. He says, <coughs> he says wherein were all manner of four footed beasts upon the, of, of the earth and wild beasts and creeping things and fowls of the earth and came a, a voice to him it says rise uh, uh, sorry it said rise peter kill and eat but peter said no it said not so lord for i have never eaten anything that is common to, uh, no sorry for i have uh, i have I've never eaten anything that is common or unclean and the voice spoke out to him again the second time it says uh, what god had planned Thou shalt call not thou coming, right? This was done thrice, uh, and the vessel was received up again in the heavens, right? Now while uh, Peter doubted himself what the vision meant, which he had seen uh, should mean, behold, the men which were sent from uh, Cornelius had made an inquiry for Simon's house and stood before the gates. So basically, you know, we people catch yourself quoting that, you know, that scripture basically means you can eat whatever you want. Well, that, it doesn't mean that, right? Because you can clearly see, you can clearly see here, it says, you know, what the Most High is called, uh, 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 what the Most High is chosen, which basically, you know, the blessed, you know, uh, 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 animals on earth that the Most High is best for us to eat, right? But it does basically saying don't call it, don't call it, don't call it, no, don't call it common, don't call it blessed. That's, that's what it is, it's been chosen, like, like, you know, like we've been chosen. So, like I was saying, you know, like, like, like the most I chose us, you know, we're not common people, we're the blessed people. So like, with the soul, we're back through this world, but it's the blessed people. Now, when we read on, basically, the story basically goes into, into into Cornelius, right? And the dream basically is pertaining to Cornelius because the, the, the dream's not really talking about the food, really the dream is talking about the, the, the people, right? Because if, if 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 the certain if you know if you see Israel he might look like a pig, he might look like the unclean the people that are from the face of the earth. But really if, if his land goes back to our people then 